how to make a command that changes your lights behind you with Lumia Stream. Quick disclaimer, they gave me Lumia Pro for free, but they haven't paid me or asked me to make any videos. If you have connected your Lumina, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to commands here. Here you can see that I have made a lot of commands already. Black, teal, white, orange, red, blue, green, yellow, purple. There's a couple standard ones in here, but I've added a couple more. If you wanna add a new command, we're just gonna click on add command here. There's a lot of different things we can make a command for, but we want a general command for the lights. What we can also do is we can click on lights. We can drag these lights over here to choose specific lights instead. But I'm gonna go for general to do all the lights. We can name the command right here. Let's call it love. Description for the command, you can give a description, but you don't have to. And then here you can show it in the command page. This is basically a page with the commands you have and people can know which commands they can use in your channel. Here we can add the delay for the alert. For example, if you have a delay in your stream, then turn this on. Otherwise you don't really need the delay. Here we have different things we can do with the lights. We can change the colors. We can not change the lights at all, but it's kind of what we want. We can have a reaction, animation, build up, interactive, lights off, heart rate sync, well, all these things we can put on. If we click on color, we can just set a value right here, like this. We can set the brightness, the duration, and the transition period. What we can also do is we can click on reaction. Here we have the police, and then it becomes like doo 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 doo, well, red, blue, red, blue, you know what I mean? <laughs> we can have a rainbow, we can have any here. You can actually make more. I'm gonna show you how to make more later on. So let's flash it and here we can set the duration it will do that for. Then another thing that is important to select is user level here, right here. If we click on this, we can see who can use this command. Anyone? Anybody. They don't have to be following or anything like that. Follower. They need to be following. Regular. Somebody you made a regular yourself and is classified in the group regulars. Subscriber. Anybody that subscribes. If anybody that subscribes there too. Tier three, people that you have made VIPs in your Twitch channel, people that you have made moderators in your Twitch channel, or we can click user and that is you, the streamer itself. Let's say we want to make this sub only. What we can do is we can tick all these off, maybe moderators on whatever you want. This way it's only for subscribers and for you. If we click away, we can see it summons which people can use it right here. We're gonna click on apply. Now we will see it says love here and we can test it. And we can see that this is what it did. If we're not happy, we can click on edit and we can make the reaction something else. Reaction, let's say rainbow and save. Let's test it now. Now it's gonna make a rainbow for quite a while. But again, you can just set how long you want it here. So if you don't want it that long, you can just adjust that right here. So what if we want more reactions? Okay, what we need to do is go back here, then click on studio and click on reactions. This is where you can make reactions yourself. There's some standard ones in here. I've made a test one, which made it yellow, but we can just add a reaction here. This is the preview of how it's gonna look like and we can test it again, but it's already pink, so it's not gonna do anything. <laughs> we can have the name of the reaction. Uh, let's do love. Cycle duration, how fast will it cycle through the different colors? Transition between them. How long does it take to go from one color to the other one? And here we have the colors. So let's say we're gonna make it red. I'm gonna add another color, which is gonna be a little bit like this. And then we're gonna cycle through these. I'm gonna test this. I'm gonna make the transition a little bit less and the duration a little bit more. We're gonna test it again. There we see, it's like kind of bouncing like a heart. So I think that would be nice for love. We can also add some audio to it if you want. We can say which lights it will trigger for. Right now it does it with all the lights and which devices, like if smart plugs and stuff like that do need to react to it as well. And we can manage the API for it as well. This is uh, if you're good with programming, you can use this. Otherwise just leave it be. Click on done. The reaction circle time is too fast. So what we see is this duration is really fast. So it's like, hmm, it might cause some issues if we're going through it that fast. So I'm gonna put it like a little bit higher and click on done, okay. Now it should be working. And if you want to add it to our commands, we're just going to go back to commands. Looks like it already made one, but we're going to edit the one we already made. And then we're going to put this on love instead and apply. Now, if people do exclamation mark love in the chat, this will happen, which is the balance between pink and red. If you guys want to see more videos on how to use Lumia Stream, make sure to leave a comment below what you want to learn about Lumia Stream. Let's jump into this video where you can do something super cool with channel points. I'll see you there.